Removing mold from the bathroom tiles is an uphill task. Till the time you watch this video and devise a method that not only removes this black ugly mold from the bathroom tiles but also prevents regrowth. Welcome to Honey Bunny Online and this is our chemical free cleaning method video series. In today's video, we will be cleaning the black mold and the soap scum from the bathroom tiles. Before that, I would love to welcome all our new subscribers and thank you all for your great support to our channel. And if you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel. If the bathroom is well ventilated and cleaned properly, there would never be a problem of mold. But let's be real, we all generally face this problem. So did I, when I saw this tiny patch of mold growing. I tried this method and it worked well. So, I decided to see how it would work on a really moldy bathroom so that I can shoot a video for you. So these are the tones which I did to grow the mold. Now all you smart people know what not to do once we have followed this method to clean the bathroom. So let's get started. I always like to remove all the bottles or hanging racks before I start a deep clean. Now I'm taking soda bicarb which is also called baking soda. I will make a thick paste with water. You can decide the consistency as per your ease but I like it a bit grainy so that it has that soft abrasive scrubbing effect. As you know, we at Honey Bunny Online try all the natural chemical free cleaning methods. This is because the chemicals are not good for health as we all know and also there is one specific reason that I've found with the bleach and the store-bought chemicals for mold cleaning. It is that they are too strong in smell which I'm allergic to and also they would not kill the mold. The bleach will just discolor the microscopic mold spores and give an illusion of it being gone. And the strong smell of the chemicals will mask the strange funny smell of the mold. So this is the consistency I was talking about. Then you can just apply it on the tiles. I am using this sponge scorer. You can use whatever you have. Or you can even make the solution more liquid and put it in a spray bottle and just spray it. I love doing it with this one as it sticks on the walls well. And I know that I am reaching every inch and corner. Let it sit on the tiles for 5-10 minutes. And then I will use my magic ingredient which is the vinegar and spray it all over. This magical combination of baking soda and vinegar not only cleans the mold and soap scum but it also kills the fungi. So once you use this method you will notice a sense of freshness in your bathroom. When there is a lot of mold you know how it starts smelling a bit suffocating. After this treatment, there will be a clean, fragrance-free freshness in your bathroom for a long time. Now it's time to see the real magic with the toothbrush. I am dipping my cleaning toothbrush in the baking soda mixture and I'm going to scrub it on all the grouts. If this video is inspiring you to get your bathroom tiles clean, please write us in the comments below. We would love to listen from you. You will be amazed to see how the mold and soap scums are totally clean and there are no black spots or marks anywhere on the wall. You can really try this method and see the amazing results yourself. Even I couldn't believe that these two simple ingredients can clean the mold so well and make the space so fresh. I have tried my best to show you the actual results in the video. It has been more than two weeks I did this deep clean and there is still no sign of any new mold. Please do share your experiences with us and if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and share with your family and friends. See you in next video.